Hey everybody, this video is going to demonstrate how to update your iPad or iPhone once an installer has made a change to your Control 4 system. So what you're going to do is you're going to hit the more icon right here. You're going to see some vitals uh, going on about your particular Control 4 system. Underneath the count info you should see your email address, uh, what director version you're on and a bunch of other stuff. Don't worry too much about that as long as you see your own email address. Up in the right hand corner, I'm going to zoom in for you right here, you should see a button called the edit button. Okay, You want to hit that button and then there's going to be a new button that's going to pop up called synchronize settings. Hopefully you can see that. You're going to hit this synchronize settings button and you're going to see your iPad or iPhone start to look like this. Okay. What's happening is they're synchronizing all the settings of the system right now that the Control 4 installer just made. Once you're done with that setup, um, you can see there's a progress bar going on right now about uh, all the different settings that we've made to our system here in the office. You will see your main home screen again. Once you've seen your main home screen, you know you're good to go and you'll have access to all your features just like you see here.